Did you know that every year the European Parliament has its say on the policies of the European Central Bank? This happens in a resolution negotiated by all political groups, and the last one was adopted just last week. This year's report is historic because it offers a solution to the long-neglected secondary mandate of the European Central Bank. The secondary mandate requires the ECB to support EU economic policy objectives when it implements monetary policy. This is a task the central bank cannot always do itself, as a non-elected institution that is not meant to make political choices. The issue is that the law refers to many objectives, such as the protection of the environment and full employment, but it doesn't tell the ECB how to implement or prioritize them. This year's resolution suggests that the European Parliament itself, as a democratic institution, can interpret the secondary mandate and clarify which objectives are a priority for the European Union, just like we've been advocating. Follow us on social media for more insights on central banking.